you guys. I had made a video yesterday and it was about a problem with connecting your Ubisoft account to the Epic Games Store account. Whenever you clicked connect on the Watch Dogs game, for me, it would bring me to Internet Explorer or Microsoft Edge to connect to my Ubisoft account with my Epic Store account. And it would say connect accounts, and then b below it, it would have a little red box that said invalid code object. So I posted a video on what the problem was, and somebody commented on my video that if you copy the URL and paste it into a different browser, like Google Chrome for instance, you press enter, it'll bring it up to you that page. So that's how you do it. So I'm going to tell you guys how to do this. I I refixed it, so I won't be able to do it again. But if this says connect, just click on it. It brings up a little box. You click on the link to connect your accounts. You go to Microsoft Edge or wherever it put you. It has a little box that says... has a little box that says... Um, invalid code object. And so what you want to do is go up to this little box up here, or if you're on Google Chrome, it's that little, like, half hemi cylinder or something. So it, it'll be, just be a bunch of letters, numbers, and symbols. All you got to do is just click the URL once, and it should be highlighted. Like, if I type in, for instance, go to apple.com. I'll click on the URL and it'll become highlighted with blue over it. What you want to do is control C or you can right click on it and you click left click on copy. You go over to the different browser like Google Chrome and then what you do is control V or paste. And then after that you can either click that first one that comes up or just press enter on your keyboard and it should bring you to the connection page for the Epic Games account and Ubisoft. If this doesn't work, there are two things that you can try. Either delete the Ubisoft and Epic Games store, delete all of the stuff that you have, and try reinstalling it, or you can restart your computer and just try again. And if you are going to delete it all, definitely just try restarting your computer first and trying a couple of times because I know a bunch of people that got it to work like that because they just tried it once but that's how you do it thank you for watching the video and I hope the problem will be fixed for you